Welcome to Introduction to Pre-Flight. First, we will begin with the right side of the helicopter with the cowl door and the instrument panel. Turn the master battery switch on and ensure that the alternator and the oil lights are illuminated. Then, open the cowl door and begin testing the emergency light switches. Each switch should illuminate the corresponding light on the instrument panel. Then, begin to look thoroughly at the engine. Check for any cracks, leaks, or damages. In the engine rear, check the cooling fan nut and ensure that the pin lines match the painted line. On the empennage, it is important to check for any damages, loose bolts, or dents. On the tail rotor, it is important to ensure all mechanical components are working properly. This includes the rotors and the bolts, as well as joints and all mechanical parts. Then, ensure that the safety light is secured and continue to check the rest of the tail for any dents, loose bolts, or damages. On the left side of the engine, check the fuel lines for any leaks, make sure the electrical wires are secured and that the battery is properly placed. Then, check the alternator and the alternator belt. After that, ensure the V-belts are tightened properly. For the main fuel tank, check that the fuel cap is fastened tightly. For the main rotor, ensure all mechanical components as well as safety lines are properly attached. Check bolts and ensure safety pins are secured. For the fuselage, check all controls. And for the nose section, check all components. And then, be sure there are no loose baggages or materials. And lastly, do a final check. 